our people, our recruits, our clients, and our pursuits have all told us how important uh, the environment is to them. So if it's important to them, it's important to us as a firm as well. And um, the environment, uh, or sustainability used to just have to do with the environment, but now we know more and more that sustainability is really uh, about how business operates as a, as a whole. And for us at EY, um, working with Sustainable Waterloo Region was an opportunity to to demonstrate and show our commitment. We have um, three pillars of uh, corporate responsibility. One of them is environment, uh, and so deepening our commitment there is, uh, is, a, is a great opportunity for us to, um, to, to show our commitment. And also, the other one of the other uh, pillars of corporate responsibility is entrepreneurship. And I think that Mike Morris and the team at Sustainable Waterloo Region are the epitome of entrepreneurship. So it's it's just a really great match for us. And all of that ties into our slogan, which is uh, to build a better working world. So EY is a bronze pledging partner of Sustainable Waterloo Region's uh, re uh, Regional Carbon Initiative. And what that means is that we have committed publicly to reducing our greenhouse gas emissions as an office by 20% uh, over a 10 year period. Uh, so this commitment is really important, as I said before, because uh, we feel that uh, the environment is part of our corporate responsibility. It's not just uh, as a corporation that it's important to us, but also because our staff and our families are all members of the community here too. I'm lucky enough to have a, a seat on the Sustainable Waterloo Region's Policy Advisory Committee. I work with a diverse group of people on that committee, so uh, that you know, personally is uh, beneficial just because I get more connected with other uh, like-minded people in the community. Um, an example of, uh, of what we've done on that committee is to help SWR uh, make a policy statement about sustainable growth within the region, take a stand on um, the importance of ensuring that growth in the region is, is going in the right direction. Uh, the policy statement recognized um, the need to reduce infrastructure costs, to reduce greenhouse gas emissions, and also recognized the importance of um, our uh, agricultural sector and the fact that our region um, contains so much high quality agricultural land. So it's been a real uh, real treat to, to work on the committee so far and I look forward to uh, continuing to work with them. So one of the things that uh, we've learned from our involvement with Sustainable Waterloo Region is the uh, importance of engaging the entire staff uh, in the whole um, journey to be uh, increasing our sustainability. And uh, one example that we've got going on in our office right now um, is a, a contest. I chair the Eco Care Committee of our office and we've got um, a contest going on where we've asked all individual uh, staff members to give us ideas of what they think we could implement to help um, with our whole you know, goal of sustainability, long-term sustainability. So uh, the contest isn't over yet, but some of the ideas that have come in so far are pretty interesting. Um, looking at ways to reduce our electricity use during the day, maybe not need to have our computers uh, plugged in all the time and then drawing um, electricity for the entire day. Uh, others are looking at waste reduction, having um, clothing drives, um, book exchanges, and there's quite a wide range of ideas coming in, so I'm really excited about that, and uh, um, I'm, I'm happy to see the, uh, the um, interest from the staff, because as I said, Sustainable Waterloo Region has, has certainly taught us the importance of engaging the entire team.